How you doing folk? Tuesday the 15th. I'm a bit full Kirk. I'm going up to I'm going up to speak to and have a blather with Joke Bar. Uh, Joke's an older guy. I think Joke served in Borneo, Aden, Ireland, uh, Cyprus. And his his memory is phenomenal. The stories he tells. Uh, are fantastic and as I say he's got a brilliant memory uh, and that's that's what I'm quite impressed with the <laughs> uh, joke's are a lot older but he's a uh, some guy and he's a, a great supporter uh, just as for Robert he knows something sinister took place the same as the, uh, the rest of his day but I stopped off to pick up some stuff uh, for, for Joke and his missus and I had a wash and shave. You don't go and see Joke Bar without having a wash and shave. <laughs> They'd put me straight in the guard room. So uh, that's where I am today. And I bought a cracking CD, UB40, the best of. Some great songs in there. Food for Thought, King, My Way of Thinking, The Earth Eye Screaming, Dream a Lie, Don't Let It Pass You By, Don't Slow Down, One in Ten, Red Red Wine, I Could Go On and Go On. Cheerio, baby, if it happens again. Uh, Shoggy McQuillan got me into UB40 in, I think it was 1980. And uh, I've been to see them, and they're fantastic. And uh, I've seen this album, HMA, HMV, 4 99 So I had to grab it. Susan's like, when do you ever play CDs? I says, in the van. <laughs> So I dropped her half a day and I couldn't put the CD in because there was already a CD in the player. I said, there you go, I told you. And I'm waiting for one coming for Bone, Bone Idol Brothers. Their music's cracking. Uh, it's like Cajun, Cajun music. Uh, so go on and have a look at them. Uh, go on to their Facebook page, Bone Idol Bros. Boys for Greenock. I went to see them today, thanks to Shoggy McQuillan for getting me the tickets to go and see them. Uh, they were fantastic. And I've followed them. And uh, they're bringing out their, their first album. It comes out on the 18th of October, which is in three days. I've already pre-ordered it to play in the van along with an old one, UB40. So anyway, so that's where I am today. I'm at Falkirk. Uh, I might go to the Falkirk wheel bit. Anybody fo is following me out and about, I'll see I've already done a video of the Falkirk wheel. So I might, I might just go there and park up and get something to eat. No bother videoing it because if you're following me, you've already seen it. So anyway, so that's where I am today, up at Falkirk. Going to see Jock. Jock's camera shy. He plays the banjo. Uh, and, I, and I was lucky that I, I, I managed to catch it. A snippet of him playing the, uh, the banjo. He's never forgave me for that. Uh, but his banjo's safe because he's camera shy. Stage fright. <laughs> so anyway, you all look after yourselves. Charlie, out and about, wash and shaved. How you doing, folk? Charlie, out and about. I've just left Falkirk and I've made it back in time. We picked Susan up for her work. It was absolutely fantastic to sit and blare with Joke Bar and have it in Anna. <laughs> They're a great couple and Joke can tell some stories and as I said, he's camera shy. So I want to thank you for the rocks for Robert's Cairn. This one came from Cape Greed in Cyprus. This one came from Western, West Australia. Simpid him. I think that's Jerpentine, Jer Western Australia, and Manfe, Exa Bay, and Rhodes. So everywhere, everywhere they've went, Joke and Anna have remembered Robert and remembered Justice for Robert and his cairn. And uh, I went to pick him up today. And thanks uh, for the trinkets, Jock, for the cat badge. And the, the collar dogs. And the good thing about the collar dogs is that they're two pinned. They're two pinned. And uh, Danny Nichols badge his chin. 
who uh, King's Own Scottish Borderer. And the, the, the other trinket she gave me. So thanks very much for that joke. And I'll not make it as long before we, we meet up again. Because I, I love listening to the joke. His stories. He's got a, I told you before, he's got a great memory. And uh, when you get when you get him talking, get him on a subject, he'll jump on it and it and that'll make him remember other things. So it was a pleasure. And uh, as I say, thanks very much for the rocks. And uh, we'll not make it as long next time. Then we watch my out in the boot. I used to go uh, up uh, up the hill with Jock. His balance is uh, away a wee bit now. So he's not he's not been up for a wee while. So that was that's me, I'm just waiting for Susan now. And then we'll get some tea, take off the road. So anyway, you just look after each other. If you're gonna date, date well, date right, date good. Don't hurt anybody when you're doing it, because that means you're doing it wrong. Anyway, Charlie out in the boot had a great blather with Jock. <laughs> oh, I meant to say, Jock's 86, and he goes about, he's, he's a 60 year old. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, thanks very much. Maybe next time we'll get the banjo out. <laughs> you hear banjos run. Thank you so much, Anna and Jock, for the rocks for Robert's Cairn. That one's for Rhodes, that one's for Cyprus, and that one's for Western Australia. So put them at the, put them at the front here. Try and keep them all together. So thank you. Thanks, thanks very much. And thanks for the, the blader, Jock. It, it was a... It was always, it's always brilliant to see you and have a good blur away. you. And as I tell everybody, your memory is amazing. But thanks very much for remembering Robert when you go to these nice places. So thank you for the rocks, for Robert's care.